my channel. I am Sammy B, the one and the only, and today we are playing the Not So Berry Challenge in The Sims 4 Generation 1 Mint. So I thought before we start off this episode, we will go over Generation 2 Rose Rules because we're already brewing up the second gen, which I'm sure you guys already remember from last episode, which was a really big shock. And Mint got engaged to Ernesto. So that was also very surprising and very exciting. So let's see what Rose Generation is all about. You had everything you desired as a child, but you were always longing for more. As an adult, you have a hard time committing to relationships as you're so focused on your career. Kind of like her mama or his. <laughs> if we had a workaholic trait in The Sims 4, you would have it. You, abs you have absolutely no parental instincts whatsoever, but you still love your child with all your heart. Traits, hot-headed, snob, romantic. Aspiration, serial, romantic. Career, politician. Rules, have only one child. Master the po politician career and complete serial romantic aspiration. Master charisma skill. Leave someone at the altar, an interaction available during a wedding. Get married for the first time as an elder. Wow, okay, that is an interesting generation. So I wanted to pre-read these now so that once the baby is born, we can kind of try to focus on maybe some traits or character or something that plays into the story about how they become the way they are. And I'm sure we will have lots of chances that the game will just write itself, and I love when that happens, but I thought maybe let's, you know, get ahead, because as I'm seeing this, it says master the charisma skill, so I think as a child, we're gonna focus as much as we can on all of the, um, like, speaking interactions and milestones as an infant, and then when they are a toddler, we're gonna focus on the, uh, maxing the social skill, and you know what I mean? We're gonna focus on that, obviously, and uh, just go from there. So I thought that you guys would be interested in seeing the rules for that. And if you guys aren't already subscribed, welcome to my family. Welcome to Sammy B's family. And we are a beautiful family on this channel where I make videos for you guys, whatever you wanna see, honestly. I make gaming videos, cooking videos, dirt bike videos, mechanic videos, fashion, jewelry, makeup, anything, gardening, construction, literally a little bit of everything. So I know that there's going to be something here that you're going to enjoy. So hit that subscribe button because it is my dream to reach 1000 subscribers. And you guys, I want you to know how much it means to me when I see a new subscriber subscribe to my channel. It warms my entire heart more than you guys know. So. If you could please subscribe, it would mean everything to me. It would help me reach my dream. And I promise to return the love and energy back to you somehow. So with all of that being said, let's move on to episode 14. Whew. Last episode was Winterfest and we celebrated it. And wow, we have a very pregnant mint um you know she's not too crazy hungry so we're just gonna get her to slip back into bed and we do work today we got a promotion last episode and we're level six top secret studies have shown that alien life among us could be could be a possibility before we can complete confirm these claims we need more proof okay well we need two breakthroughs so i think first thing she's gonna do when she wakes up is have a oh no this broke a nice thoughtful shower. Perhaps we could get on the uh, breakthrough train. Ooh, it's night on the town. So maybe her and Ernesto can like hit up the, hit up the club. I don't know, hit up something. Mint today is a little bit of blue in my inner corner and I have a little necklace with a little, little ball on it. So it's just a little subtle today, a little subtle mints, but. Oh, and my drink has mint in it. Some kombucha. If you guys haven't tried kombucha, I highly recommend it. It's, it's got a good, caffeine dose if you guys like caffeine and kind of tastes like pop kind of like juice and it's got a ton of health benefits one of the health health benefits being it really cleans you out 
which is never a bad thing. Detoxifying properties. Today I'm drinking the Synergy Raw Kombucha Trilogy flavor. I'm not really sure what that means. The ingredients have like kiwi juice, raspberry juice, lemon juice, and ginger juice. It's actually quite wonderful. Woo! She is awake and really has to use the bathroom. Let's take a thoughtful shower. I'm gonna get him to vacuum uh, lightly around the house. Ooh, that would make him actually uh, very focused. I wonder if maybe mint should do that. Um, do we have any leftovers? I think we do. So I'm gonna get him to come on in here and maybe do a little bit of cleanup while mint takes care of herself. And maybe we'll just grab some leftovers since he's a little hungry and we'll just swip swap for the bathroom. Okay, so now Ernesto can, you, uh, he could just do E. Let's give him a bath actually. That's sounds nice and relaxing. And Mint is eating some leftover pizza. Pepperoni, pepperoni. She wants to uh, flirt with herself. Okay, well we can do that. And she starts work in an hour. So I was wondering, she's inspired not quite ready for a breakthrough yet. Oh, also, before I get too far into today's episode, I know, so remember how we talked about only buying, like, mint rewards? Well, I was thinking, like, we don't have to just have the mint ones. Oh, I see, you can buy this one over and over again. Well, we probably won't need to do that. But I was thinking of buying ones that could also help with her, so entrepreneurial means that the sim is more likely to get promoted in their career and I think that would really help us out so I'm gonna get it you know these points are here for a reason and there's no rule saying that we can't so now that she's flirting with herself I'm gonna get her to oh now she's flirty <laughs> I'm gonna get her to a vacuum around the house before work because that could put her in a focused mood also I don't know if the mail was delivered yet no it's not but we are waiting on some results from the crystals so we might be able to finish the element collection today, which would be very, very, very exciting. But yes, this house is a complete mess. Are you guys excited for second gen? I am so stoked. Oh wow, he is so playful. Let's uh, let's get him let's get him to grab some leftovers real quick here, because he is starving. And I don't want to send him to work starving. That is the worst. This is actually my breakfast today. I'm trying to focus on my health. Ernesto can now take family leave. I know we're trying to get promoted as fast as we can, but I think we should spend a couple days when our newborn is is here. Or it might even make more sense to do it when our newborn is not necessarily a newborn, but maybe an infant so we can start working on those skills. Unexpected visitors. Alert! Aliens have infiltrated these headquarters and are trying to pass themselves as humans. Very suspicious. Be on the lookout for them and any sabotaged equipment. Ooh, that's kind of scary. Okay, Mint, experiment on the chemistry laboratory. Experiment! Because we might be able to get you a breakthrough. It kind of had a little light bulb beside it. Our little pregnant Sam working away. Oh, I think that is so cute. Ooh, she wants to tell joke about his body hair, Cade. The guy that we had enemy, we were enemies with, and then we just ended up not knowing him at all. <laughs> Super random. Tell, oh, order a coworker to analyze. Okay, let's see if we can do that. Analyze Flora. Cade, since you came and talked to me, can we, can we do that? Darn it, no breakthrough, hey? Okay, let's see if we can get him to do that. And then, a lot of tourist stuff, but I kind of want to stick inside the building right now. Practice analysis. Uh, that would be over here. Ooh, there's someone there. <gasps> I bet you this is an alien. Because they're talking about, like, imposters, right? I'm going to freeze him. And then we're going to repair it. Oh, yeah, I bet you he's an alien. Caden Curtis. Ha. I saved the day. Hopefully that doesn't affect our performance. It kind of looked like it did. I don't know though. I wasn't really totally watching. <laughs> Ooh! Did she get electrocuted? Hmm. I don't know what happened there, but we can practice analysis now. But she just got the fear of death. Death is inev inevitable. Mint knows that. Mint just didn't think that it would be. she would be thinking about it so soon. There's still so much to do. How will Mint get everything done if death is just around the corner? Is it safe to just hide forever? I bet she's kind of 
thinking about her baby and like what happens if something happened to her at work. Hello, Mint. This is Cade reporting that my attempts to analyze the flora yielded the death flower. Whoa. Order a coworker to analyze crystal. Also, we should grab our parts. Let's joke around with... Oh, can we... Should we give him a tainted serum or not yet? Let's see. Mischievous. Let's uh, share a conspiracy theory. We go. Gotta work on our mischief hey, skill. Girl. And then we have to order him to analyze a crystal. Because we are not quite... We're getting there. Start neighborhood hive mine. What should we do today, you guys? Let's do knockout. No, let's do happy town today. We're in a good mood. We're in a flirty mood. We're gonna be nice today. Okay, so now she really has to use the bathroom. Mix a serum. Okay, let's uh, maybe quickly do that. Let's do red hot and then we'll get her to use the washroom. The crystal analysis resulted in nothing of interest. Okay, that's strange. What's that sound? What happened? Weird. Success! Mint has successfully created a serum. Now we gotta do is test it. Write up research on the computer. Is there a computer upstairs? I don't think so. <gasps> Wait, there should be in here. That would be kind of cool. This chill office. Never even actually seen this before. I didn't even know we had workout stuff. That's cool. All right, well, um, how are we doing on our career thing here? Not great. Okay. Oh, all the computers are like taken. There's gotta be another one somewhere. All of the computers are taken! Ugh, no fair. All right, guess we're gonna go insult some tourists. It takes up a lot of our time running all the way out here to like the boundaries, but there's always food out here. Three sisters chili. What the heck is that? I'm not, I'm not gonna lie to you. That looks kind of good. Come on, Mint. Hurry your little pregnant body up here. Who's this? Okay, let's, uh, do we know any of these guys? No, I don't think so. So we are going to uh, do a funny introduction to Tom X. All right, and now we have to tell a funny story. Tell, yeah, tell a funny story. We go hang out here for our lunch break. And then we also have to insult him. So, or maybe we can insult someone else. I don't, I don't know. We'll insult this guy, maybe. Mean. Oh, he's leaving. Okay. Well, this guy's the lucky guy, I guess. Mean argument and argue. How do we insult? Malicious insult. Oh my god, he just left. This is kind of getting a little crazy. Let's insult. And then we have to hug a tourist. Ooh, that's gonna be tough. Let's apologize. Be like, I'm sorry, my pregnant hormones are getting to me in a very crazy way. And maybe we'll do some mischievous little pranks. Maybe he'll like that. We gotta try to hug a tourist. I don't know how much time we should spend on uh, trying to get this one done because we don't really have a good relationship with any of these tourists. So it might take a while to get to the point of being able to hug this guy. But I'm just gonna do a couple mischievous interactions. And maybe if he ends up liking it, then we can hug him. This is my plan. But he's getting angry. We're at 64% of mischief skill. 67. I don't think their relationship is going up. Do I know any of these ones? No, I don't. Well, we're gonna give up on this. Oh, but we have to use a Simray on a tourist. So let's freeze him. I don't know. Why not? We got pretty high on our mischief, though. Oh, and we should grab a bowl of this stew since we're super hungry. There we go. We got that. Oh, we have to scare a tourist. Let's uh, do a funny introduction. Oh, is he leaving? How come everyone we try to talk to disappears? <gasps> wow. Well, we could definitely scare this guy. Okay, I think he had enough to eat. So let's try to scare this tourist. Apparently, we really, really hate him. I, I don't remember where he's from. Were we trying to prank his house at one point? Lucas Haro? There. Mint's work day will end in one hour. Oh, and the Festival of Lights. I mean, night on out of town. I mean, maybe. Wow, we did not do very good. I am going to stay late. 
I know it's night on in the town, but we still we still have time. Lie about career to a tourist. So that would be in mischievous. So we can lie about our career. We're like, no, we don't we don't work there. Not at all. I don't think we'll be hugging a tourist anytime soon though. She got really embarrassed. Start perpetuous rumor with a civilian. I feel like this is a civilian, so let's start perpetuous rumor. Preposterous. Preposterous? Oh, we're definitely working on our mischief skill. Crack open. What? That's so weird. It's like following my orders. That is so weird. That is so weird. I didn't really know it, it kind of followed the game. Can you hug me after that? Wait, wait, can I yell at you please? Just really quickly let me get out my uh, anger. Really quick, real quick. If you don't mind. You are trash. Give a tainted serum. Oh wait, I don't feel like this is gonna work. We don't have a good relationship with him, but we're gonna get him the synthetic food one. Not be too, too mean. He's like, I ain't drinking that. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna be able to give anyone one of those. I, well, definitely not this guy. We're just not friendly enough with anyone. I don't think anyone's gonna take our serum. I'm going to give it a shot with this one, just because I don't know if we have a lot of time. Give Tainted Serum. The Slimify. Ooh, we just peed herself. It's okay, we're pregnant. It's, it's fine. Like, hey, do you want to try my new slimming recipe? Oh, wait, we have to give Makoto. Oh, I see, I see. Whoops. Well, I don't even know if we have enough time to go in and write something on the computer. Oh, boy. Uh, I don't know guys. I think we should either dig for crystals or work on our mischief skill by just, I don't know, being mischievous to Luca because that's what we like to do. I don't know. We are here already and we don't have a lot of time. Um, unfortunately, we ended up staying late at work to work on our mischief skill, which is kind of sad. Uh, didn't mean to really do that, but... We're gonna do some pranks on this uh, girl. We're gonna ask her due date, be like, did that slimy potion work? Because you look pregnant, girl. I don't wanna be too, too mean to her, but I also wanna just really work on our mischief skill because we're, we're getting there. 88%. Darn it. We did really good though. We made 1459. So it does say we made a fantastic, we did a fantastic job. So let's head out to the Festival of Lights, or maybe we could just go down the street to Elixirs and Brews Bar and obviously get a mocktail for ourselves. Oh, but she probably should quickly sh It's so late already. Like, do we have to do the night out on the town? She doesn't even really care, but... Ernesto, what are you up to? How come it's still filthy in here? Let's get Ernesto to maybe vacuum around. Let's see... Darn it, I should have got him to work hard. It says visit a venue. And I don't think elixirs and brews counts as a venue. But honestly, it's almost 10. I just, I don't think we're gonna do the night out on the town thing tonight. It's just not gonna work out, okay? Um, she is pretty tired, but let's get her to take a little bit of time to uh, maybe just talk to Ernesto, maybe ask him about his day. At least she already ate dinner at work, and Ernesto's actually doing really good with his needs as well. Oh my gosh, it's taking a long time. So, actually, let's theorize about aliens, because we uh, we work in the same place, so I feel like that's something he would probably really like to do. Besides, they're totally impartial to going out or not. They're like, eh, do you want to? Nah, we can go out on the weekend, you know? So, I think it'll be totally fine. Here we got that out of the way. And she wants to listen to lullaby music, but it's broken, so I'm gonna get her to repair because she's a very, very handy sim. And Ernesto wants to mourn the dead, eat food, and cloud gaze with mint. Aww. All right, well, if you wanna eat food, let's, uh, but you're not even hungry, so, like, why? <laughs> why, Ernesto? 
Mint wants to listen to lullaby music, so what I think we're gonna do is perhaps read a little bit of Logic Level 3 in this room after she's done and listen to lullaby music. Because she's ready to pass out, but nothing like reading before bed. Oh, she didn't quite fix it. Interesting. That's literally all she had for today, hey? Alright, well, I don't even think we made it 1%. Oh, wow, she's gotta be in trimester 3. Yeah, she's ready to pop. She's giving birth today. I can tell you that much right now. She is giving birth today. We are having a baby this weekend, which actually works out really well because we don't work in three days anyways. So that's, that's kind of perfect. So that gives us a lot of time to work on getting breakthroughs and get ready for things for... Oh, we're focused! Oh, and we had a breakthrough! We had our 11th breakthrough. And we wrote through, down the idea for Electroflux Wormhole Generator. What is that? Whoops. Wait, whose birthday is it this weekend? Mint's birthday? Okay, wow, this is gonna be a very busy weekend. <laughs> okay, <clears throat> where's the notebook? Electroflux wormhole generator. This ultra advanced piece of technology allows brave Sims to travel to an alien world filled with exotic and interesting things. Hopefully you can find a way back home once you go through. We need any element, crystal, and metal. So we have metal, we need two crystals, which we can probably just grab from our garden if we want, and two elements, which we can even just throw these in our pocket. So um, that's so exciting. So I think we should definitely try for one more breakthrough uh, because we're kind of already almost there. So let's keep reading that logic book and see if we can get that 12th breakthrough, which would be so excellent. Let's go mint. Let's go mint. Okay, well we did our best, but we made it to 47% done this part of our logic skill. So we actually did quite well. So she's exhausted. So let's let her uh, head back to sleep. Ernesto's up in the middle of the night playing games, but I think we should maybe just try to get a little bit more sleep because the baby is going to be coming any minute. And it's New Year's Eve, mint. Uh... Ooh, you love to party! Yes, she does. Yes, she does. But she loves being like mischievous at parties, like lighting fireworks and stuff. Ernesto, get back to bed. Oh, wow, this baby is coming. This baby is coming. Like, she... <sighs> She's... Let's see if she can maybe just eat something out of her inventory. Like, I don't know, a basil? And then just go to bed? Like, just... I don't know. Why not? It helped a little. <gasps> I knew it. Oh my gosh, I knew it. She's in labor. She's in labor. Okay, Ernesto, I need you to... What do you want to do? Be friendly? So let's comfort Mint real quick. Let's uh, let's have a deep conversation real quickly. And then we're going to go to the hospital. Or should we just have our baby here? Because, I mean... Now we're just going to go to the hospital. Have baby at hospital. Here we go. Ernesto's going to come with her, obviously. And... Second generation is unfolding right now. Are you guys ready for this? I don't know if I am. Here we are. Willow Creek Hospital. Let's give Ernesto a quick, quick kiss to kind of uh, calm him down. Be like, I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm just really, really hungry and in a lot of pain. And let's check in at the front desk. We are here. Here she goes into the room. Ooh, big room with big skeleton. Scary, scary. A New Year's Eve baby. How special. Oh, the, ma the machine's doing it on its own without the doctor. Can we like be friendly with the doctor as she's working on us? Look at our little slippers. Having baby delivered. Mint has learned Valerian is a medical intern. Oh, she's just an intern. Is it a girl? Is it a boy? Is it twins? Oh my goodness! Mint's having a baby! Oh my gosh. What should her resolution be? <laughs> so random. <gasps> a baby girl? Oh wow. Okay. Um, ah! A name. I didn't even think of a name. What are we going to call Red Jen? I was thinking of calling her Rose. So I don't know if that's something you guys 
want to do, but I am gonna name her Roseberry. Congratulations, the doctor has prepared the birth certificate. Wonderful, look at Rose! Look at our little baby chicken leg! Oh, she's beautiful, she's got beautiful eyes and here, she, here we go red gen at its finest let's uh let's make a quick resolution we could raise a skill yeah that could be we reached parenting level one mint can now encourage kids' behavior influence kids to clean she can reprimand bad behavior by asking the child not to do that action or simply yelling at the child to stop here we are so that's our resolution and i guess yeah we're just gonna head home welcome to the world red gen rose let's give ernesto a nice kiss because we just had a baby and let's also maybe put on uh since it's new year's eve let's put on like a nice little party outfit and we'll give his resolution to raise a skill as well put on his party outfit and let's go okay i'll get oh she's sleeping okay let's not wake up our little sleepy child but i do want to get mint to repair this so we can have lullaby music going at all times and i think she wants to wow probably invite ayla over for uh new year's eve which would be nice well who they can autonomously do that <laughs> i did not know that was a thing i did not know that was a thing okay go guys that's really fast after having a child can you imagine if they got pregnant from this i mean i know it says woohoo so they probably use protection but i'm just saying like what if oh, that's crazy i did not know that was a thing okay we have to get in the mood so we can dance play an instrument so we'll probably tell jokes flirt maybe sing wow ernesto's I was like he's sleeping okay let's get your uh outfit back on because uh, you immediately rip those clothes off and perhaps what do you want to do you want to be alone and chat with tom ox well that's two totally different things so i'll just get you to like clean up the house and be alone for a while while mint listens to uh where's lullaby lullaby radio Meliku, guess what? You have a younger sister. And then let's read <laughs> logic level three. Oh, he hasn't had attention in a while. Time to read. Ernesto, what is this thing? Oh, he can like experiment. You know, maybe we can get, or we could get his mischief skill up. You know what? Let's work on his mischief skill because he is mischievous like her. And I think that that would just be really cute if they could be like little mischievous peeps together oh okay there i was like oh is that he he doesn't have the option to troll the forum uh yes he does oh baby sad baby needs food baby is hungry change outfit to do we have anything with red very cute look look not so berry berry last name there's red <gasps> look at that outfit Oh, Rose is so cute. We're gonna talk Lux, we can coo at her. There's no skills we can work on while Rose is a baby. But, ooh, Rose is not liking that. Remember, Rose is going to be a politician. She's gonna rule this country. And she's a snob and she just has a really hard time finding love. Not sure how we're gonna write that into the story, but we're gonna give it our best shot. Ernesto's hungry. Oh, Reese says congratulations. Well, how about we invite Reese over? I think that would be kind of nice. And he also wants to chat with Tomax, so let's invite both of them over. He hey, ignores you. this tradition from being a loner, but he does want to count down to midnight, so that's what we can do with a buds when they get over. Uh, where are they? They should be here. Here they are. Reese is here, so come on in. Who's this? And Tomax. I think he just wanted to be friendly with Tomox. Don't yell at my cat, how dare you. Mint, 
How's Rose? Rose is doing good. Okay. Uh, how about we invite over Ayla since it's New Year's Eve and we can have a little bit of fun time with our friend. She really wants to party. So let's go in here and... Oh, I didn't know we could tinker. Slow dance? We can only slow dance? Okay, let's slow dance with Ernesto real quick here. We unlocked the close-knit lifestyle. Ooh, I like that for her. Okay, Ayla is here. So let's just, I guess, apologize. I don't know, for something maybe we did at work. And then, ooh, I forgot we still have to get married. I mean, we don't have to. We could express our admiration for her. I don't know why we can't hug her. We could blow horns, you know, like really get in that... We could do something mischievous, you know, share a conspiracy theory. I'm glad you don't think my llama jokes are getting old. I feel like you just get me. We can describe the apocalypse. Oh, baby needs something. Ernesto's on it though. He is on it. I bet baby's hungry. Oh, baby needs diaper change. Oh, that's his first time seeing. Change dirty diaper. And now he's level one. He's doing so good. There you go. Why don't you talk to our little Rose? And let's uh, let's go talk to our friend. Oh, she's getting a phone call or a text. Brent Hecken. Oh, no, I'm sorry. I don't want to go to the romance festival with you. Oh, and she's talking to Tomax. She needs to do a little bit more in regards to like getting in the party spirit. Ooh, but she really has to use the bathroom. Okay, well, we're gonna do that next. Ooh, let's clean up. That's kind of nasty, having guests over and it looks like that. <gasps> How did she get a break, her 12th breakthrough on the can? A ghost goo serum. What? Okay, that's cool. Ghost goo. We need mushroom. Okay, we gotta find some mushrooms. I wonder if we could just order some mushrooms. I mean, we have a bit of money, so... Let's see, let's order delivery, grocery, and we need three mushrooms. I feel like this is the easiest way. What, why are they so expensive? Okay, we're not doing that. That's insane. I am so stoked that she got her 12th breakthrough. We still need to get to in the whole party thing. I wonder if maybe, okay, what is it? We could sing. Let's, uh, can we sing with her? Gossiping. Just trying to get that checked off there. Inside joke. Anything with a little symbol. There, we checked it off or almost checked it off. We're so close. Joke about old times. Mint, of course, the life of the party. We're almost there. We can do an impression. Okay, can we, like, sing or something? Can we, like, sing around the Christmas tree? No, I don't think so. Well, I think she would set up a firework outside, so we're gonna do that. You know, nothing like New Year's fireworks, am I right? Oh, people are starting to leave. Maybe we'll do it in the front lawn. So let's go over here and let's light this firework. Happy New Year! Okay, Ernesto, do you want to come here and see- Oh, don't do it too close to the house. Okay, Mint, let's see your shenanigans. Oh, it's mint color! Oh, that is so cute! Oh, everyone's coming to see. Well, maybe we should light some more. Ernesto's like, oh, okay. Well, I, I'm gonna go start watching TV. He loves this TV. Now that that one's done, let's light one more. What color is this? If it's red, I would like shit a brick. And she wants to cloud gaze. Well, I don't think we're gonna do that at 9 p.m. But oh, and a fire started. So let's extinguish with the freeze ray because you know us. Say goodbye, she says. Whimsical. Complete 100 whims across all Sims. Nice. The Berry household received $35. Uh, an insurance payment. Oh, because we had it on the rug. That's uh, typical me. Typical me. Let's uh, kind of clean up after our shenanigans. Maybe clean the concrete. I know it's snow, but still, we'll just kind of clean that up. And Ernesto. Oh, yes. Yes, take care of our little child. Maybe she's hungry. So I think maybe we should give her a nice bottle to have. And then we'll coo at her. And then... The party's in here. Watch New Year's Eve TV with everybody. I'm glad that at least uh, two of our guests stayed. 
Look at that, everything's nice and cleaned up. We used up some of our fireworks. Ooh, did the mail come in? Oh, this could be our little gift to ourself. And then we'll watch, ooh, then we'll eat and then watch the television as well. We're, wow, Ernesto's parenting level two. He can now influence kids to do homework. Ernesto can firmly tell kids not to do bad behaviors. He can select more options when responding to a teaching moment. Oh, that's exciting. And he completed his resolution. That's because he maxed a skill, which parenting was not the one I had in mind, but that's okay. Okay, we're gonna put the vacuum back out. Let's see. Oh, guys, 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 guys. Okay, mint, mint. Uh, I'm, I'm panicking because like we might, we might actually have been able to, to finish this. Oh man, we don't have anything to kind of eat. Shoot, we'll just have to microwave something real quick here. Microwave a pastry. Okay guys, are you ready for this? Everyone's in here watching their New Year's Eve TV. Mint is just about there, but let's see what we have here. Bozone, I think we had that one already. Bolton, I think we had that one already. Oxypin, I think we had that one. Apparently we do. I guess so, it's right there. What about this one? Gooblick? <gasps> Wolfium? Yeah, I think we have Wolfium. I think it's this one right here. Yeah. What about this one? Sidrolin? One more. Lathium. I think this is like a hint at the color. Shushubi! Oh my gosh, it's Shushubi time. Okay, we got one. We need two elements left. This is tough, you guys. Oh, and we gotta hang our little... Mint, come in here and watch. Come in here while you eat. Mint, don't miss the countdown. Okay, hurry up. Go, go, go. We cannot miss the countdown. Shashubi! Shashubi, Mint, Shashubi! Shashubi! Happy New Year! We did it. What about the New Year's kiss? Don't forget your New Year's kiss. We'll do a, a suave kiss. New Year's Eve kiss. New Year's kiss. Oh, I think he's had an out. Oh, he's so happy he completed that. And then let's compliment uh, his outfit. Ooh, wow, the love language of touch from Mint just made that moment truly magical for Ernesto. It has Ernesto pondering the joy of a tender caress or the comfort of a warm embrace from a beloved sim. Is this a moment of realization that Ernesto likes physical intimacy? I would say so. And Mint is charisma skill level three. She can now donate to online charity, practice pickup lines in a mirror, I think she would do that, and can flatter other sims. Yeah, yeah honestly, I think she would. Ooh, should we? No, I'm not gonna try for a baby right now. I want to, but uh, I think we'll just woohoo. And is uh, Ayla here or did she leave? I think everyone left. The party's kind of over. Well, I am glad that we got at least one more element to add to the collection. I just don't know where we're gonna find those last two. We don't have to panic. We still have lots of time. It would just be nice to get this done and over with. And to finish off the evening, a little woohoo in bed with, you know, our fiance, which we really should make our husband. But here we are and our little Rose, our little second gen. How beautiful, look at her beautiful blue eyes mint because both her parents have very bright blue colorful mint eyes so beautiful look at her she's perfect we've got the lullaby music going oh wow they are going hard that counted as a friendly interaction well, you guys, I am going to pause this episode here. I hope you enjoyed today's 13th, 14th episode. 14th episode of the Not So Berry Challenge Mint Generation. I am so excited to start working on second gen's goals. We still have to finish Mint's goals, but we are, every single episode, we're just getting a little bit closer to finishing them and we are almost at oh no we we did we had our 12 breakthroughs so next episode we'll probably be getting promotion we'll probably even maybe master the mischief skill because we are almost there 
and the logic skill we're still working on but we can always work on that at work and we just have to complete this last little part of our chief of mischief aspiration and then she is complete uh, oh, and the elements collection, but we will be digging for crystals for sure. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you subscribe to join the Sammy B family, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye, guys. <laughs>